Hello everyone, my name is Holden Hardman. Thank you so much for joining us again for another video. We are starting our journey through Pirates of the Caribbean because on Patreon we did a poll for the next movie series we wanted to watch since nobody cared about The Matrix and everyone voted for Pirates of the Caribbean. Now, I did have one of my patrons suggest that I take the top two that were voted for and sort of interlace them. We have done that before and I think this would be a really good idea. So what was number two that won? It was? I once saw him kill three men in a bar with a bouncer. John Wick. So we're going to interlace Pirates of the Caribbean and John Wick, and I'm super excited to do that. It keeps us from getting burnt out. It changes the pace for some people that may not be as interested in pirates or may not be as interested in John Wick and gives them something to look forward to every week. So I think that that's gonna be a good move on our part. So hopefully you'll enjoy that. All right, we're gonna be getting into Pirates of the Caribbean. This took, I remember this was such a huge franchise. Uh, I remember it was in a game called Kingdom Hearts, uh, getting to see Jack Sparrow. I think it was one of the first movies based off of a ride. It was based off the Pirates of the Caribbean ride at Disney and the fact that it did well enough to earn a franchise says something too. What all do you know about the franchise? Do you know anything about this? Any idea of what to expect? I did see part of this one. It's been quite a while. I think I saw part of it when it first came out. Big fan of Johnny Depp. And um, despite the controversy, drama behind him, I think he's a great actor you know, and I like him. So I obviously know that uh, pirates are involved. Um, like I said, I don't recall much from it, which might work out well for kind of rewatching it. I don't know anything about the the follow-up films. Wait, so have you seen this one? Or I've seen parts of it. Okay. I haven't seen all of it. I think I remember most of the beginning because Kira Knightley, I know she's in this and I mostly recall her. I really am excited to finish it up and even more see the follow-up films because I don't know if Johnny Depp is in all of them. I'm assuming so, why would he not be? Yeah, who's to say? Uh, I'm really curious. This is very different from all the movies that we've been watching lately. So I'm excited to kind of switch it up a little bit. I don't think we've watched any movies with Johnny Depp in it. I don't right? think so. So I'm really excited. I like him and I'm sure these are gonna be really, really good. And we can't forget about the comment of the day. This one comes from our last in real time Boba Fett episode, uh, which I think was episode six. This is the life of a cameraman, says as a huge Boba Fett fan, makes me really sad that the creators behind this show don't have as much faith in him. The show just hasn't done the one thing I wanted. All I need is one scene to all the haters and show them why Boba is the best and why so many people love him. I'd love to know your thoughts on that because Boba Fett kind of shifted over to sort of a the Mandalorian. We got to that awesome sequence with Luke, at least as of right now. And in, in real time, the show is not over yet. So I'd love to know some of your thoughts on that. But thank you so much for your comment, uh, comment of the day. If you want your comment featured in a comment of the day, leave a comment down below. We'd love to know your thoughts on the Pirates of the Caribbean. Again, thank you so much to our patrons who voted so that we could watch this. If you would like early access to select videos and uh, get to watch the full length reaction with us, check out my Patreon. You can do that. You will need your own copy of the movie though in order to watch along with us. But with that being said, let's go ahead and get into this one, Pirates of the Caribbean, The Curse of the Black Pearl. Did this make a lot of money? Mm -hmm. The whole, the original trilogy did. Oh yeah, it's all coming back to me. I don't remember this part. <gasps> Quiet, Missy. Cursed pirates sail these waters. It's bad luck to have a woman on board, too. Even a miniature one. <laughs> oh, Jesus. I... <laughs> you know, we really do glorify pirates, you know, or at least make them like jokes, but they really were like horrible. Want you to accompany the boy. He'll be in your charge. Take care of him. Never, ever. Do you imagine me being like, Savannah, take care of that 13 year old boy. Don't leave his side. Be like, throw him back overboard. <laughs> I thought I heard Fox. I'll go check out. Fox is homesick today. You're a pirate. <laughs> oh, this is so me. The story of my life. The blade is folded steel. That's gold filigree laid into the handle. Forged in I know, I knew you were going to say that. 
Commodore Norrington is going to be very pleased with this. I had a dream about you last night. Oh, he's mm. got the hearts for her. The day we met, do you remember? How could I forget, Miss Swan? My first erection, Miss Swan. <laughs> okay, that's the only one. That's the only one. Just a joke. It was a joke. It was just a joke. It was just a joke. <laughs> there he is. Here comes Jack. This really is like one of his best movies. I do remember his like character just kind of being like all over the place. Yeah. yeah. He's like always kind of drunk. Pirates, he'd be warned. <laughs> Hold up there, you. A shilly to tie up your boat at the dock. Boston and Falcon as people. This dog. Black Pearl is a real ship. It's not. Yes, it is. I've seen it. You've seen a ship with black sails. Couldn't possibly be any other ship than the Black Pearl. Is that what you're saying? <laughs> Aye! If he were telling the truth, he wouldn't have told us. Unless, of course, he knew you wouldn't believe the truth. He told us. <laughs> I think the British did a lot of trading with them. I think that's why they're over there. Either way, someone will correct us and give us the whole history. Please do. I say that condescendingly. I actually am curious, but... Me too. I can't breathe. Yeah, sorry. I'm a bit... Yeah. <laughs> and then they made me their ch... <laughs> Will you be saving her then? I can't swim! <laughs> do not lose this. Do not lose these. Aw, Johnny Depp. <laughs> I never would have thought of that. Clearly, you've never been to Singapore. <laughs> <laughs> Where did you get that? Do you really intend to kill my rescuer? <laughs> Heavily thanks are in order. Had a brush with the East India Trading Company, didn't you? Oh, yeah. Pirate? Hang him. <laughs> Keep your guns on it. Jack Sparrow, isn't it? Captain Jack Sparrow. Here I love his facial expressions. No additional shots nor power. <laughs> <laughs> A compass that doesn't point north. You are without doubt the worst pirate ever. But you have heard of me. <laughs> <laughs> the day that you almost caught Captain Jack. <coughs> I love how he's just like going with the flow. Yeah. There's people up there. If I step here, very good. <laughs> now, you have no weapon. Oh! Who makes all these? I do. You need to find yourself a girl, mate. <laughs> Rough and irritating. You cheated. Pirate. <laughs> You've assisted in the capture of a dangerous fugitive. Destroying <sighs> my civil The drunk. Uh -huh. You remember this from the ride? You're like going through and the dog has the keys and they're like trying to get it to I come. I don't remember that. We got stuck on the Pirate to the Caribbean ride when there we went to Disney. There you go, miss. With that Will Turner. He's a fine man too. Oh. Begging your pardon, miss. Just drooling. It's like, you know who else is a fine man? That Will Tanner. Wouldn't mind him forging my steel. I don't even know what that means. That doesn't mean anything. But it sounds, but it sounds like it does. Harmon, that's so dirty! Wouldn't mind him banging that hammer on me. That's that's better. That's closer to... <laughs> so good. Wouldn't mind him straightening my tail. Holding, oh. stop! I've heard stories. Never leaves any survivors. No survivors. Where do the stories come from, I wonder? <laughs> oh, I remember these two. This is Falcon in Boston. Mm. Hello, chum. Oh my gosh. You've got something of ours and it calls to you. Hello, Poppy. Polly! You, you have to take me to your captain. I know the code. She'll go. Come on, Daddy. It's 
just you and me. No, 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 I didn't mean it. Last time I saw you, you were all alone. His fortunes aren't improving much. <laughs> oh, that's cool. That's very interesting. I'm here to negotiate. <laughs> speak <when> you speak. <laughs> Do not lay a hand on those under the protection of Parley. Apologies, miss. Oh, I love the little chimp. I want you to leave and never come back. I'm disinclined to acquiesce to your request. You have a name. Turner. Hmm? Oh, yeah. It's Definitely Turner. wants that bloom. Family heirloom. Perhaps. According to the code of the order of the Reverend. The code is more what you call guideline. <laughs> Jeffrey Rush. Great actor. They've taken her. They've taken the hobbits to Isengard. Now, Elizabeth, you were familiar with that ship, the Black Pearl? I've heard of it. How far are you willing to go to save her? I'd die for her. Oh, good. <laughs> <laughs> not possible. Oh, it would have an air pocket, just not that big, and what's they would be able to the, walk. Yeah, what's keeping them on the floor? An air pocket would be trying to get right. out. This ship cannot be crewed by two men. I'm Captain. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Ladies without doubt, the worst pirate I've ever seen. Search every cabin, every hole, that's the belt. <laughs> Thank you, Commodore. We've had a hard time of it by ourselves. <laughs> Got to be the best pirate I've ever seen. <laughs> no, no more for you. Moochers, freeloaders. Sweet angel babies. You knew my father. No. I am your father. It's not true. Bring away something. <laughs> Pirate is in your blood, boy, so you'll have to square with that. I can't bring this ship into Tortuga all by me onesies, savvy? <laughs> not by me onesies. <laughs> Tortuga. Oh, dear. Not sure I deserve that. It was she. What? A man deserved it. Gosh, I'm already awake! That was for the smell. What makes you think Bob Bush will give up his ship to you? Let's just say it's a matter of leverage. Mm. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. The kid? Who said if that be the case, you'll be dining with the crew. And you'll be naked. Oh no. Fine. <laughs> He's like disappointed. Oh, pirates. They got a good chef on board. You must be hungry. Like that to me on our first date. That's pretty much how you eat anyway. <laughs> like, so Jennifer, it's so nice it's uh, finally our first date. <laughs> and the apples. Oh, this is our first date. <laughs> we just given you food. <laughs> seen at Best Buy back in the day to show HGTVs. Yeah. We are not among the eleven, and so we cannot die. Best start believing in ghost stories, Miss Turner. You're in one. <laughs> <laughs> He's a mute, sir. We did let his tongue cut out. So we trained the parrot to talk for uh. <laughs> <laughs> Is that Gamora? What? Zoe Saldana? Yeah. You'll get another one. Wow, I didn't even realize. Time to go, Poppet. What's with the Poppet term? I don't know. That was before I'd met him. Back when he was popping in the flock pearl. What? I shouldn't have said that. He was the captain of the Black Pearl? A maroon jack on an island and left him to die. Not before he'd gone mad with the so that's the reason for all that. <sighs> he roped himself a couple of sea turtles, rushed them together, and made a raft. What did he use for rope? Human hair. My back. Ew. <laughs> <laughs> For ten years we've been testing the tribe. 
accursed center of Cortez himself. Whose blood must yet be paid? The blood of Jack. Sorry, Jack. That's it? Waste not. Did it work? I don't feel no different. How do we turn? <laughs> You're not dead. No. Was your father William Turner? No. The medallion! She's dangerous! You're supposed to be dead! Am I not? Hey boy, where be Jack? Jack Sparrow. So options were limited. The girl's blood didn't work, did it? Hold your fire! <laughs> I'm sorry. Blacksmith's hand. I know they're rough. Oh, here we go. If you hadn't betrayed me and left me to die, I would have an equal share in that curse, same as you. I'm having a thought here. <laughs> this is the fastest ship in the Caribbean. You can tell them that after they've caught us. Load the guns! With what? Anything. Everything. Oh, that's interesting. Do it, the dogs! Or it's you will look into the cannons! <laughs> Stop blowing holes in my ship! <laughs> <laughs> They're doing the best they can. Ah! <laughs> uh. <laughs> Thanks very much. <laughs> That's not very nice. Monkey! Monkey. Well, thank you, Jack. You're welcome. Not you, we named the monkey, Jack. <laughs> 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 I can. <laughs> Who are you? No one. There's no one. Lovely singing voice now. Yeah. My name Unic. is Walter. This is spitting image of old bootstrap Bill. How much water? The crew are not to be harmed. Agreed. Oh. Did a good job on those teeth. I agreed she go free, but it was you who failed to specify when or where. Yeah. We have a that dress back before you come. <laughs> <laughs> he shouldn't be able to tell if it's warm or not, though, from the stipulation to the curse. Too long! Too long! Perhaps you'll be able to conjure up another miraculous escape. Off you go. You can be the gentleman and shoot the lady and starve to death yourself. It's a pretty island, though. It really is. How did you escape last time? The rum runners used this island as a cache. Came by and I was able to barter passage off. That's the secret grand adventure of the infamous Jack Sparrow. Three days lying on a beach drinking rum. Welcome to the Caribbean, love. <laughs> yo, ho, yo, yo, ho, a pirate life for me. But the company is infinitely better than last time I'm taking. Poor pimp. Freedom. <laughs> Just wait, Captain Sparrow. It's a master in terrible for you. What a bloody is now! There'll be no living with her after this. <laughs> I beg you, please do this. For me. As a wedding gift. Are you accepting the Commodore's proposal? I love weddings. Drinks all around. Drinks all around. <laughs> oh my gosh, she's so funny. I love weddings. <laughs> I'm selling a story! <laughs> Strapped a cannon to bootstraps, bootstraps. Was Bill Turner 
cursed as well. It makes it sound like he was part of the crew. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I suppose so. <laughs> what do you have to lose? Nothing I'd lament being rid of. Which includes the Asian Mrs. Commodore. They can't be killed! Don't worry, miss, he's already informed of that. Little Mermaid flopped up on deck and told him the whole story. Dick. Yeah, for real. <laughs> 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 you get to die for it just like you promised. So we're all men of our word, really. <laughs> Except for Elizabeth, who is, in fact, a woman. <laughs> Your funeral. <laughs> because the HMS Stunt <laughs> is floating just offshore, waiting for you. You think he wasn't telling the truth? By all means, kill the will. Just not yet. For instance, after you've killed Norrington's men. You've been planning this from the beginning. Yeah. We have an accord. What a great scene. Yeah. There's Boston Sweet Falcon. Boy. Sweet girls. Where'd she get the boat? Oof. I wonder if there's like an adult show about pirates. This is more aimed towards, you know, still, young kids. Still Disney, yeah. Yeah, I'm trying to, I feel like there was something. It turns out you're a hard man to predict. There we go, yay! I knew it was a good guy. You're off the edge of the map and meet. Here there be monsters. <laughs> Miss Elizabeth. <laughs> they can't kill him off. What? That's interesting. <laughs> Remember, he stole the uh, piece. Oh! I didn't realize I could continue like after the initial curse was. Yeah, I think it's just so long as somebody steals it. Must be what like steals twist. it from the chest because Elizabeth definitely stole it from Will. Yeah, but that's a nice little twist. So what now, Jack Sparrow? We'd be two immortals locked in an epic battle until Judgment Day. Or you could surrender. <laughs> And hang the rules. They're more like guidelines anyway. Bloody pirates. <laughs> They're stealing our shit. This guy's eye, man. Oh! Try wearing a corset. I like getting the occasional one liner. No fair. Would that not like kill him? Like, I wonder how that would work. <laughs> Ten years you carry that pistol, and now you waste your shot. But I mean, he shot him before. Yeah, I think I always think the same thing. Maybe because the I bullet's see. already in there. Cold. Oh no, it's apple. You didn't even taste the apple. <laughs> <laughs> Parlight. <laughs> the ship is ours, gentlemen. <laughs> <laughs> Your fiance will be wanting to know you're safe. Aww. <laughs> if you were waiting for the opportune moment, that was it. <laughs> <laughs> He's over here looking like Robin Hood. Impersonating a cleric of the Church of England. <laughs> I should have told you every day from the moment I met you. I love you. Atta boy. Right in front of her fiance. This is how 
you thank me? By throwing in your lot with him? At least my conscience will be clear. You forget your place. It's right here. And my axe. This oh, is mine. Yes, I think we've all arrived at a very special place, eh? Oh, spiritual. <laughs> I was rooting for you. <laughs> There's the day that you... <laughs> Idiot. Perhaps on the rare occasion, pursuing the right course demands an act of piracy. Mr. I mean, he seems to be a commendable guy, honestly. This is a beautiful sword. I expect the man who made it to show the same care and devotion in every aspect of his life. What about Sparrow? I think we can afford to give him one day's head start. This is the path you chose, is it? Here's a blacksmith. No, he's a pirate. Oh, even better. It's been eight days since I've washed. Ew. I've never once brushed my teeth in my life. <laughs> oh. <laughs> the black pearl is yours. On deck, you scabbers dogs! And for grace! Drink up, me hearty Joe Ho. Just finished Pirates of the Caribbean, The Curse of the Black Pearl. This is a really good action adventure movie, I think. We don't watch a whole lot of like adventure movies, I feel like, so it was, well, I guess with the exception of Lord of the Rings, but it was nice to kind of watch this one. What did you think about this? I really liked it. Um, I did see parts of it and some of it came back a little bit, but there was a lot that I either don't remember or haven't seen. I really think that Johnny Depp makes this movie. It's definitely one of those movies where if it was somebody else playing him, I don't know if it would have had the same like impact. For me, the biggest thing was I felt like he kept it light. It just his like comedy that was kind of like sprinkled throughout were like perfect. They were perfectly placed. They were just, they kept it really interesting and they kept it from being too serious, I guess. So I really, really enjoyed it. He's probably my favorite character out of all of them. But I really liked the guy that played Barbosa. I think it's Jeffrey Rush, yeah. you said. He was equally good. Really good acting across the board. Really enjoyed those two kind of bickering and going at it. Very, very fun to watch. In the beginning, I kind of mentioned that it's like a different tone than most movies, even action movies. You don't see many movies or TV shows about pirates. They really hit it on the head with this because it's very unique. And I absolutely love the scenes where the pirates were in the moonlight going from like normal composition to these like skeletons. Those were like my favorite scenes. I really, especially the one scene where they're all underwater and they're kind of going, you know, under the boat and then coming back into the moonlight and seeing that transition was, Really, really great. I liked it a lot. A lot of action. There was a couple of scenes that I felt like could have been not dragged out as much, but overall, I really enjoyed it. Johnny Depp's character, he's so like loopy and kind of really just go with the flow. Like I'm gonna see if this works and if it doesn't, oh well. And he's just like really, he's not dumb. Like his character is not dumb. He's very out there and kind of quirky, but definitely not dumb, very smart. I just really liked it. His little lines that were sprinkled throughout the movie, like just landed every time. He was truly meant to play that character, 100%. Orlando Bloom did a really good job too, playing Will Turner. But for me, like Johnny Depp just, like stole the spotlight for me. Um, I was very focused on him. I'm very curious to where the second one is gonna pick up. So Barbosa was killed. Does it mean they're gonna pick up on the second one with the rest of the crew? Is there gonna be a completely different storyline? I don't know, but I thought that the, the premise of this movie was brilliant. The Commodore, I'm guessing we're not supposed to like him, but I really liked him. I mean, he seemed like a stand-up dude. Usually in those movies where like, he's the guy that really loves her, but she doesn't love him, they kind of make him out to be a dick. And in certain scenes, I mean, he wasn't a dick, but 
I liked him. I thought that he was a stand-up dude, and I appreciated the, the last scene where he was just like, you know, I clearly don't make her happy, and this is someone that does make her happy. Take care of her. So I really appreciated that scene, and I loved the final scene with Jack. The fact that, like, I mean, as laid back as you can be, he's about to be hung, you know? Turner comes and saves the day and puts his life on the line for him, and um, I really, really enjoyed that. You know, there's a lot of scenes that I felt like could have been really cheesy, but they ended up like working for this film, which is really weird. Even some of the acting from like the pirates, the crew, was a little cheesy, but it's like it wasn't cheesy in a way where I didn't like it. You know, it was all kind of goofy and not goofy, but like just very laid back and funny. There are definitely some more serious scenes. I know this is Disney, but I didn't expect some of the scenes to happen, like slitting people's throats and stuff, but I appreciate it. I'm here for it. So I really liked it a lot. I thought it was a good movie. I'm really excited to see the second one. The one negative is, you know, Kira Knightley, she did a good job in this, but I don't necessarily like care about her. I, I'm sure I'm in the minority here because I know people think that like she's phenomenal, but I was really just here for Jack Sparrow. I mean, that's, that's it. That's the reality of it. I get, you know, throwing in like a little romance with uh, Will Turner and that was fine. As far as like her solo scenes, I was just like, I wanted to get back to Jack Sparrow. He definitely made an impact for me. I like him a lot. I thought overall, great movie. I let my kids watch it. I would watch it again. I really liked it. Yeah, I don't know if they were planning to do two and three. Maybe they were waiting to see how this one did. I think that this was kind of like a Matrix situation where they did um, two and three together. And yeah, I'm really curious to, to see what you'll think of uh, both two and three, and four and five, since there are four and five as well. The only thing I would say about this one is that the CG is probably a little dated now, like as far as the skeleton crew. Looks, you know, early 2000s, um, still good, you know, probably would be done a little bit better today. This is honestly just a really solid, like, movie on its own. This was the start of a franchise, whether they intended it for, to be a franchise or not, I'm not sure. But yeah, we don't see a whole lot of like fantasy pirate stuff mm -hmm. uh, anymore. There, there is some like in, uh, you know, the Assassin's Creed Black Flag game was a big one about pirates and stuff, but not a ton. And it was just, it was just like a refreshing popcorn flick. I think this movie is really solid and Johnny Depp obviously is iconic. The music in this is obviously iconic. So yeah, what would you rate this one? You know, like I said, I liked it a lot. Um, it also felt just very original. There were a lot of scenes where I predicted it to go one way and went the other. So I really, really liked that. There was a lot of scenes that I thought were brilliant to add, like just the scene with Jack Sparrow and Elizabeth being trapped on that island, which is, you know, the second time for Jack. I thought that was great because we kind of see how Jack and Elizabeth kind of deal with each other, which was absolutely hilarious. He made the comment of like, she's gonna be intolerable after this. And I thought that was absolutely hilarious. I thought it was a great movie. I don't really have any like major complaints about it. I know you mentioned like the CG could have been better, but honestly, like, I didn't care. I, I knew that this isn't like a real life thing. So my mind can like, you know, suspend belief for that. And the fact that it's not like absolutely great doesn't really bother me. So I'm gonna go with a nine. I think I will go with an 8.5. Really solid. I'm looking forward to doing the next two. I, I'm looking forward to doing four and five as well, but you know, the, the three are the main the meat and potatoes of it. I hope you're going to enjoy watching the rest of the Pirates movies with us. I also hope you're going to enjoy watching John Wick with us as we interlace them. And uh, and yeah, if you enjoyed this video, leave a like. It does help the channel out a lot. Comment down below. We'd love to know your thoughts on Pirates. Subscribe so you'll be notified next time we post a video. Also check out my Patreon. You'll get early access to select videos as well as getting to watch the full reaction with us. Just make sure you have your own copy to watch with us. We watched this one on Disney Plus. So if you do watch with us, Probably uh, that version will be the best because sometimes we get some delays like people that have Blu-rays and we're streaming it. But So that would probably be the best. Anyway, as always, Jen and I appreciate you watching. We'll catch you in the next video. Take care.